These are the Power Block Elite 130s. They go up to 130 pounds per hand. Uh, as you can see, they are so large that the dumbbell actually sticks out at the end of the stand there. But, uh, you know, for any activity that you'd be doing that would require that heavy of a dumbbell, you're probably, the, the length of the, the dumbbell is not a factor. But anyway, I just wanted to show you a couple of things here. On the big block, which is the weights, uh, basically above 90 pounds, it uses a slightly different system than the selector pin there. You have to use this big block retaining pin. This kind of acts as a double safety because it is so heavy and so large. But you can see there's that's uh, for one plate, that's for another plate, that's for another plate, and depending on which hole you, you put it in, uh, that determines how many plates you're actually picking up with the rest of the dumbbell. But it um, still feels pretty solid, even at those heavy increments. These are the two and a half pound chrome adder weights, and they give you basically some of the in-between weights, that's, my camera's probably blurring that, but, uh, you know, it weights like 17 and a half pounds, 27 and a half, 37 and a half, and so on and so on. So, it really, you can really get exactly the weight you're looking for with these. And to put them in, you basically just uh, pop the switch into the open position, drop them in there, close it with that lever. That lever just basically lowers into place uh, a metal plate that holds them in there. Can be a little bit loud, but uh, it's not too bad. Actually, I'll show you that real quickly. That's about the extent of the noise from that. So, again, these are just the Power Block 130s. Pretty nice product, very solid. It's pretty, uh, pretty amazing that they could engineer something that was that's so selectable in terms of weight increments but yet uh, still very very solid